Hey guys, Blue Tony here, and today I'm gonna discuss some stuff. Um, obviously, it's gonna be a little late, you know, but I feel like I need to address it, so that's what I'm gonna do. Um, everyone knows the of the departure of Gareth Edwards, of him not coming back to make the second Godzilla movie, Godzilla 2. Um, and that that's definitely going to be a fucking problem. That is absolutely going to be a problem for the rest of the trilogy because um, this next director that w who can who will take over these movies, I don't know who is, but they can openly decide, you know, really anything. They could fuck up. You know, the rest of this. I mean, it, honestly, from this point, it's going to be hard to fuck up because, you know, you have a, you're, you have like a, a, a good, strong base for a trilogy. But is, this guy can really, is really the, on the borderline of fucking up and not fucking up. Just because he can do so much to manipulate. You know what he wants to do with the film and what how the characters say things. Obviously, there's a writer that to uh, write what the characters should say, but really, the it's it's all on this new director, whoever it may be, to really deliver on this film. Because if this director does not deliver what. Or even close to what 2014 was, Godzilla 2014, then Godzilla will be looked at and will always be looked at the same way it has been in America, based on it just like it'll be looked on like 19. It'll look like Zilla. Godzilla will revert going back to Zilla because of this giant crisis is that it, that's how I'm putting it because it is jeopardizing what, how America sees Godzilla you know and I don't want that to happen you know Godzilla has a very bright outlook right now in America it's probably at its pinnacle of popularity in America for maybe the past 60 160 two years I think 61 years I, I believe that's what it is 61 years uh, it's been a while um actually no 62 yep 62 years all right I, I got a fucking brain fart there holy shit well I can say 61 and a half because it's not November yet or no wait why the fuck did I say November is it November I don't fucking know I, I, I am lost. Oh, no, it is November. It is November. I'm pretty sure it is. I don't know. I'm all fucked up here. So just bear with me. Bear with me. Because I am impromptuing the hell out of this. But, um... But it's it's at its pinnacle point that, than it has been. At It's at its pinnacle of popularity sent for than it has ever been for the past 62 years Godzilla has been around. The last time I remember Godzilla being popular was, well, you know, in America. I, I'd make an estimate. Uh, probably in America, 1984 maybe. I, that's the last time it's been mediocrely popular. You know, I'm not ripping on Godzilla or anything like that. But I think that's the last time Godzilla ever see, received any type of popularity. Because I know 2000, I know that didn't do well in America. I don't think that did well in America. Just because it was kind of like, there. Like, it came out in America, but it was just there. Like, nothing spectacular. But, yeah, 1984 was definitely the last, uh, I think... The last time Godzilla was ever really popular, other than the fact of 2014. Um, so, that's... Uh, anything else I want to touch up on? Uh, I mean, just adding the fact that a while back they got the rights to King Ghidorah, Rodan, and Mothra doesn't help either. 
it doesn't help the matter at all just because that you know uh, you know it, it's a different story if it's just a monster alone and you know it's you know it's hard to explain you know it was a different story with 2014 it was a different story because it was starting out fresh and we got a strong basin for a strong trilogy but now we throw in three other Japanese monsters that really confuses everyone. Like, how the hell are these monsters going to pop up? You know, what the fuck is going on? How is Mothra going to, you know, really do all this with her fairies or, you know, what? you know what I mean? You know what I mean. But how is that all going to be? How is everything going to be incorporated in the second film? How, I don't know how it will be incorporated. It's just a really fucked up situation that Gareth Edwards left, you know, this brand new director. You know what? I don't know what the fuck Gareth, was, Gareth Edwards was thinking about leaving. You know, this is, it's his trilogy. So he needs to fucking finish it himself. You know, not get just hand off to some new, some new director that doesn't really know what the fuck they're doing. You know, what the fuck are you supposed to do with King Ghidorah? Is he going to come out of the fucking... It'd just be so fucking cheesy to Amer today's American culture that it, it, I will say, and I, I am not holding back, it will flop in the box office. It will absolutely flop in the box office. It will be criticized by every single American in America and really give everyone a false hope. It really will, especially to the... Godzilla, every Godzilla fan out there, even Japan would make fun of us because this may flop like forever. This may go down as one of the worst Godzilla movies out there. And, I, and I'm not, I'm being dead serious about this, you know? I, I just don't think Gareth Edwards left, he left this brand new fucking director whoever he, it may be you know he left him in a really bad situation that really jeopardizes Godzilla in many ways and before the question comes up that is DeAndre Jordan over Godzilla's face doing his dunk face back in 2013 just just thought I had to bring it up um that's really about it this is really why Godzilla 2 and how Godzilla is viewed throughout America, maybe the world. This is how this is how Godzilla's reign in America will end. That's it guys. Um I will see you next time whenever that may be. I mean, I mean, I've been uploading recently, so it honestly should be today or tomorrow. I don't, I mean, I don't know. All right, so later.